Microsoft PowerPoint is a great tool for creating visually engaging presentation that can captivate the audiences. Today we're going to be talking about PowerPoint. PowerPoint tips and tricks that will transform your presentation skills and increase your efficiency while using this powerful tool. And the best way to start is to hit start. Often we insert shapes and text boxes and want to place them in the center or specific location. Grids and guidelines are handy tools to do that. You can go to view and check the guides box. This will give you a vertical and horizontal guide going through the center of the slide and you can use it to insert shapes right in the center. You can add grid lines from the same view tab. Grid lines help to align shapes and text boxes. These are also useful for maintaining uniform empty spaces across the slide deck. You can right click on the slide, click on the arrow beside grids and guides and select smart guides. Smart guides will help you to position objects by showing lines and indications in red dotted lines in the PowerPoint. Another useful feature of Microsoft PowerPoint I often use for positioning and alignment. If you are Microsoft 365 user, you can access the designer tab of PowerPoint to get some auto-generated design ideas for your slide. Click on it and choose from different design generated to design your slide within few seconds. Another useful tool is the eyedropper tool. This will help you to pick colors from image or text or any object to format your texts or shapes with the same color. Save a lot of efforts and help to create slides with uniform colors. If you are presenting from your laptop to secondary screen in a class or in front of audience, presenter view is a lifesaver. Put the slide on presentation mode and right click and click on presenter view. You can create notes which you can see on the right side while presenting. There is also a clock on the top left corner that will help to track the time you are spending for presentation. Presenter view also allows you to preview the next slide and you can easily go the next slide by clicking arrow or clicking on the right arrow of keyboard. Pretty useful, right? PowerPoint's Merge Shape option allows user to create wonderful infographics. You can use multiple shapes to create new ones. Select two shapes and go to Shape Format, and then Merge Shape. Choose from the Combine, Union, Fragment, subtract these options to create new shape. You can also edit fragmented shapes and allow your creativity to generate excellent shapes and infographics. PowerPoint's Align Tabs tool helps you arrange text or objects in a tidy and consistent way. With this feature, you can set specific alignment points on the slide, like left, center, right, or decimal alignment. These alignment points act like markers, letting you line up your content neatly at those spots. You can adjust the spacing between these markers, making it simple to create indents or outdents. This tool is really handy when making lists, tables, or lining up items in a visually pleasing manner, giving your slides a polished and organized look. The animation pane in PowerPoint is a powerful tool that allows you to control and manage all the animations on a slide. With this pane, you can easily add, modify, or remove animations for text, images, shapes, or other objects. It provides a clear timeline view, enabling you to reorder animations, adjust their timing, and set specific start or trigger conditions. The animation pane also lets you preview animations before applying them to your slides ensuring a smooth and visually appealing presentation. Animation Painter is a time-saving tool that allows you to copy animation effects from one object and apply them to other objects with just a few clicks. Simply select the object with the desired animation, activate the Animation Painter, and then click on other objects to transfer the same animation effects. This feature is incredibly useful when you want to maintain consistent animations across multiple elements on your slides, eliminating the need to manually recreate the same animations repeatedly. The Slide Master in PowerPoint is a powerful feature that allows you to control the consistent formatting and layout of all slides within a presentation. To access the Slide Master, simply go to the View tab and click on Slide Master, or use the keyboard shortcut Alt plus Shift plus M. 
With the Slide Master, you can save time and maintain a uniform design throughout your entire PowerPoint deck. By accessing the Slide Master view, you can make universal changes to elements like background designs, font styles, colors, and placeholder positions. These changes are then applied across all slides in your presentation, ensuring a cohesive and professional look. Finally, I will show how to add a hyperlinked agenda slide in a presentation. Add a blank slide and add the title. In the text box below, keep the mouse pointer and go to Insert Tab and Link. Click on Place in this document and select the slide you want as first chapter. Do the same for the other chapters. This will help to create a hyperlinked agenda slide. If you found this PowerPoint tips and tricks tutorial helpful and think that it will help develop your presentation skills, make sure to like the video and comment your thought. If you are new here, please subscribe for more contents like this. Thank you for watching.